no matter where you looked around in the circle, you could see artillery flashes. So you knew from, we knew from that that we were surrounded. But we went through a couple of shellings uh, at Bastogne that were uh, earth shaking. If you lived through them, you remember them for the rest of your life. And I'm not sure you're the same for the rest of your life after you've lived through them. You never forget them. Welcome back, heavy heads. You know what time it is. Getting back into some Sabaton. We're going with Screaming Eagles today. By the way, I too am a big World War II buff. Uh, if there's a documentary on or anything like that, I'm watching it. So uh, I got into a little bit of a conversation there briefly in the comment section about Band of Brothers and the Pacific as well. So if you haven't seen those, I would definitely check them out. If you're into World War II, uh, some people read I am more of a video watching kind of guy. Uh, but that's just me. Uh, let me know in the comments, what are you guys watching? What do you recommend uh, for World War II? But that's enough of that, Sabaton, Screaming Eagles, I'm ready for it, let's go.
they knew where we were and uh, they started shooting uh, point-blank 88s into our area. They were letting us have it, everything, everything. They come in the kitchen sink, mortars, airflow whoppers, that's a rocket thing, that's a screaming sound. So, uh, of course, a uh, badass song, uh, definitely some real goosebumps there, uh, partly because you know how this ends. Um, and this video did a really good job of kind of putting you in, in their position uh, as much as you can go in your imagination. So obviously I've talked about before with Sabaton how they really give me that sense of camaraderie that's never been stronger than imagine at least. Uh, digging a foxhole in the winter, hard ground, you're surrounded by fire, and surrender is not an option. Not an option whatsoever. So, you know, you just can't help but kind of get chills and goosebumps from that. Great song as well, um, but, you know, I, I feel like I was really just wrapped into the video more than anything else, but this song is going to go on my playlist. Until next time, guys, keep it heavy.